Hi everyone, this is Hannah, your Osborne Books and More consultant. I wanted to talk to you today about two of our newer titles that are really popular in my house right now, A Thousand Animals and A Thousand Things That Go. They are nice, thick cards, um, hardback books with kind of card stock pages, and I wanted to show you so that you could kind of see the detail in these pictures. Um, they are just so much fun. And Thousand Animals is exactly that, a Thousand Animals. I love how detailed and pretty the pictures are. And if you can see kind of the fun little eyes that are on these animals, they're really fun and funny. And they're perfect for all ages, from baby up until adult. My husband and I both love looking through all these. And I love them because it's great for, you know, vocabulary expansion, for babies and toddlers, picture recognition. And then it really appeals to the preschoolers' need to kind of name everything. And then as your child gets older, it's really great for kind of, you know, um, discussions and also expansion with some of the things they may be learning in school. It um, breaks animals up by region and area. Um, so if you're learning about Australia or about Antarctica, you can kind of talk about the animals that you might find there in the desert. And also different types of animals that they might find. So it's just a really fun book. The pictures are so great, and um, it's just, it's great. So night animals, and then there's a index in the back for you to find all those animals. A Thousand Things That Go is literally a thousand things that go. So this is my three and a half year old's favorite book. If you have a child who knows the difference between an excavator and a front loader and a bulldozer, then this is the book for you. Um, it has just really great detailed pictures. This one is my son's favorite right now. It's the dragon boat. And it has all the vehicles. Again, great for um, vocabulary building and naming. And then my six-year-old, who doesn't really have an interest in vehicles at all, loves to look at it because there's some really obscure and fun um, vehicles that are just kind of funny to name. And then there's some great history information in here too. Um, there is old-fashioned things that go, so you can kind of learn the history of the different types of vehicles. There's the locomotives, steam locomotives, so you can talk about the history of the train on up. Um, and then, again, like I said, there are just some really fun, obscure ones that are just fun to talk about. So these two books are just great. My son reads this like a storybook. We have to sit and we name them all and he'll know if you kind of skip any. Um, but then he'll also sit and my daughter and him will sit together quietly and just look through and find all the funny pictures and they just really enjoy it. So these are just two great ones to have in your library. A Thousand Things That Go and A Thousand Animals. Thanks.